You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop. I'm going to check out a pretty crazy looking game here called Bone Brain Skull Game. Ouch, ouch. Look at that. Ouch, ouch. Ideal game for the whole family. Two different game levels, obstacles and place markers. Two different interchangeable wands. It's for ages three plus. I get to test my coordination with the beginner or expert levels. And it's kind of like those arcade games. I've seen them before where you're moving this electric wand around this maze of a wire and not touching the edge. And when you touch it, as you can see here, it zaps the game and sets off my skeleton to doing crazy things, which is pretty fun to see. Now it's from the 90s, exactly from 1997. There's how to change the batteries. A little bird pops out of his head, his eyes light up. So we're going to see. How about this? Let me get it out of the package. Oh, I did notice an original price tag here on the bottom. It says, new lower price, 10 bucks. And it's a fun maker game. All right, well, let's see how fun it is. I'll come back with this out of the box. We'll check it out, set it up, and we'll play it. All right, check out my skeleton. Now the wand, I got to get that out of the packaging here. This had never been used. I did test it with batteries just to make sure it was working before I started. I sometimes get things that have never been used and then they don't work for whatever reason sitting so long. So you have the instructions. Now that came with these extra, like I said, the extra wand and these little pieces which you add on to make the game more difficult. So you have the different little numbers, one through, let's see, three, four, five, that was six, and six, and then you have six of these little metal pieces, but they're almost like a plastic, they feel like plastic. But they're still going to set the game off. I dropped one on the floor, sorry about that. And now let's see the wand. You have to just pull this out? I'm not sure. Okay, so you might have to unscrew that. Let's just see how to play the game. All right, so here's the instructions if you don't have them. You can pause and supersize the video, and here is the back. Okay, when you get skilled, you can win the game repeatedly. Try the super expert challenge that you can create yourself. Snap the maze, enhance the obstacles onto the wire, or change to use smaller wands so the game becomes more difficult. I can't see which one is smaller. Which one did you say is smaller? I'd say this one is smaller and it's already on there. You'd think it should just pull out. But maybe not. All right. Let's see. You can mark the. It doesn't tell you how to change the wand. Troubleshooting. I don't need that. Let's see. Player chart. Okay. How to play the game. Beginner level. Game over. You won. All right. Well, it doesn't tell me how to change the wand. Let me read this a little bit here. When you get so skilled, you can win the game for you. Try the super expert challenge that you can create yourself. Snap the maze. Enhance obstacles. So these are called the. Maze enhance obstacles. So these go on the maze, but I'm not going to put them on yet. So you put one here and then number one near it, so you know that's the first one. So when someone says, I got past level four, then you know you've got to try to beat that. All right, why doesn't it tell me? The picture just shows it pulling in and out. Not anything about a screwdriver, but there's a few screws. You shouldn't think you'd have to do that, though. Let's just try to wiggle. Okay, yeah, so it does pull out, and it's not easy. But it looks like there's a metal pin in there that connects onto this. And you push in. All right, enough chit-chat. So level one, level two. Let me turn it to level one. Level one gives you 60 seconds to move around. Now watch what happens. I'll just touch it right now so that we can get this out of the way. So you start the game by pushing on the little hole right here, the metal piece right here. Once you push that, it activates. Make sure this is in all the way, and then the game will start. Here we go. Now it's started. Oop, I just hit it. So now I restart it. I hit. Right. I gotta switch here. I know, I know. 
Hold on a second. I'm trying it left handed. I don't want to do it left hand. Let me reset it. I am. I'm being very careful here. And if, once you touch the other side, it'll say, you win. You won! You won! See that? It looks like as long as... No, okay, it stopped. All right, here we go. So now I'll reset. I wonder if you could reset it this way. Okay, so it doesn't. You have to restart it this way. So I have one... Oh, I hit it. Right, let me do it again. Ah! I, oh, I hit. Right, let me set this to 30 seconds. Let's see if I could do 30 seconds this way. Here we go. Oh, I hit right away. Ah. I'm doing as fast as I can. Did I do it? Got it. All right, so obstacles. Now watch. Now they show these going out, the little clip part. So if you put this out, clip this on, and they show this clipped on. So that is like number one. Let's put it on the outside turn here. They don't really say you have to put them in any particular spot. There's two. This should make it harder now. Let's put it upside down in the little dip here. There's three. All right, now we're really gonna challenge me here. Well, let's go this way, here's four. I should show you the back of this thing, right? Do you wanna see more of this toy? Batteries on the bottom, okay. And then here's the back, so you can kind of see it. Pretty plain, but at least you've seen it. All right, let me do four, okay, five. Let me put five in a really hard spot. Way out here. And then six, right when I'm coming to the end. Oh, dropped right in there. There we go. All right, six is right here. Right at the end. Okay, now it's going to be much harder. Let me go back to the full minute and try it there first. And then here, let me switch the wands just to see. Challenge myself. Okay, here we go. Start. Oh, right away I hit it. Ooh. I got to switch hands. All right, let me move this to my right. Oh, okay, all right, all right. Simmer down, simmer down. Well, let me zoom in to the little birdie. Watch out. Here we go. That's hard to do. Like, I can hit the plastic here. Ah. Ah. It's definitely harder with this one, I think. Just the way it's designed. Because you're going to have to switch hands. If you want it this way, I'm not sure you could do this the whole way. Ah. Alright, alright, alright. Simmer down, buddy. Simmer down. Here we go. I'm going to switch to the right hand. I am, pal. No need to tell me. Now sometimes you just touch it, it doesn't go off. Like I hit it there, but it wasn't enough to set it off. You won! You won! Look at him. His tongue goes, he goes nuts. All right, let's do it again. Let's go to the 30 second now. Here we go. Now watch, if I touch this plastic piece, it goes off. 
So they are sensitive. If I touch this plastic piece, it doesn't go off. Here we go. 30 seconds. I hear you, buddy. I don't want to set it off. I'm going as fast as I can. Ha! Got it. All right. What do you think about this little game? And this crazy skeleton. Let me try it in the dark. Let me do that. I just want to see him in the dark. I want to see his eyes flash. I'll be right back. Game over. All right, here I am. I can, uh, oh, I am back. All right, I am back, as you can see. I can still see it. There's enough light for me to see. Here I go. You probably can't see me. Oh, there, I hit it. All right, let me do this. I want to do the win. I'm going to do it from the outside and just press the outside and then press the other side. Here's a win. All right. Back to light. I just wanted to try that just to see. All right. Not as exciting as I anticipated. I did this. Watch. I touched here. Then I moved this over here and I touched here. See? Now, sometimes that little birdie, see, it is a little birdie, sticks out here. He should close all the way in, but maybe he just doesn't every time. All right, it is the Skull Game. Do you remember these games? Have you played this type of game in an arcade? I know I've seen them, but I don't know what they call them in the arcade. Either way, it was fun to check out. It was cool that it works, and not too hard to play. And thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. And if you want to see more games like this, look in that description for a playlist. Or as always, you can search Lucky Penny Shop. Let's say goodbye here, buddy. Say goodbye. Yeah. Ouch. Game over. Oh, I guess if you do it three or four times, you lose. And thanks for watching. Later. If you're looking for the item you just saw in the video, click here. Watch more videos by clicking here. Don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up. Hey, LPS Dave. What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh, yeah. Please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. And always remember when you see a lucky penny, pick it up. Thanks for watching. <laughs>